Hi everyone, welcome back to Catherine's Plates. You know, every day is Mother's Day when you have your kids in the kitchen helping you make your favorite brunch recipe. Now, they went through my cookbooks, they went through my blog, and they found a recipe that they wanted to make because they knew I love these. What are they, Joseph? They're the breakfast sausage and egg muffin cups. Oh, I love these any time. You can make a bunch of them, you can freeze them, you can use them all week, you know, for breakfast, just pull them out and microwave them, but I love these. What's your favorite items in a cup? Uh, sausage. Sausage. What's yours? Probably sausage. Probably sausage. All right, so that's what we're going to start off with because we have one pound of, this is a Jimmy Dean breakfast sausage, and what Joseph's going to do is just turn the heat on, brown this up. While he's doing that, Rihanna's going to add our favorite veggies that we like. So we're going to put this on a medium-high heat and brown that up, and then while you're browning up your sausage, you want to maybe cook your vegetables also. Now we're doing onion and we're doing some sweet peppers because I love the sweet peppers in them. All right, 350. All right, then he's gonna start breaking this down and we're gonna make sure this is cooked until it's no longer pink. Rihanna's gonna add the onions and just chop up some peppers until they're about the size of a dice, a very small dice. Now when you're adding meat to the muffin tins for our egg cups, you want to make sure that the breakfast sausage or your breakfast bacon is totally cooked through. All right. Now, if you're using ham, you can just chop that up and that's fine. And the same thing with your vegetables. Now, we're using about half of an onion here. Dice it really small and we're going to cook this through with the sausage. That way it can be nice and soft and tender. When she cuts up the peppers, we're going to add those also. So any, if you like spinach or if you like asparagus, anything like that, just cook it down first. Because these don't take very long in the oven. So we want everything cooked first. How's it going over here? Good. Looks good. Some color in there. Okay, while Joseph is finishing up browning up the sausage here, Rihanna is going to spray a 12 cup muffin tin. Now this is just a standard size. We're just using some non-stick cooking spray. You want to make sure that you really get into the sides of it in the bottom. This will prevent them from sticking. Let's go ahead and get a, two, a tablespoon. And what we're going to do is place two tablespoons of this mixture into each cup here. So we're going to turn off the burner. Now if you need to drain your grease from the sausage, you can go ahead and do that at this time. Right now though, as I'm looking in here, there's no grease to drain, so it was pretty lean. So now what we're going to do is place two tablespoons of this mixture into each cup. There you go. All right, now if you have extra sausage that's been cooked up and you don't have enough room into your pans here, that's totally fine. I love to have extra sausage for a morning. You can freeze it or just stick it in your refrigerator. You could add some taco seasoning to it and make tacos with it, with that sausage. Okay, the next step is to prepare our egg mixture. Now we have a large bowl here and 10 eggs, which Joseph is going to crack into here. And then we're going to season it with these seasonings here. And Rihanna is going to be in charge of that. Okay, Rihanna. So right now I'm going to do the um, onion powder. It's going to be a uh, quarter of a teaspoon. Now I'm going to do paprika as well. It's going to be the quarter of a teaspoon. Next I'm doing garlic powder, quarter of a teaspoon as well. Now I'm going to move over to the salt. It's going to be half a teaspoon, so it's going to be two of the uh, quarter. And next is going to be pepper. Again, it's going to be half of a teaspoon, so two of the quarter. Okay, 
Is that all 10, Joseph? No, nope, one more. One more? Yeah. All right. Now, to make this creamy, we're going to add a quarter cup of heavy whipping cream. And then, Joseph, you're going to beat the heck out of it. <laughs> we have our whisk here. Okay, the next step, what we're going to do is Rihanna's going to add just a little bit of cheese to each of the sausage here. Just like that there. All right, while she's doing that, Joseph is going to add our egg mixture into each cup. Now, we're just using a quarter cup here. We're not going to pour it all into there. You only want to fill these up three quarters of the way full because these will bloom up. All right, we're going to place these in the oven that's been preheating at 350 degrees for about 15 to 20 minutes. We're looking at a nice golden top to the crust here. Do the toothpick test. Take your toothpick, place it into the center of it, and pull it out. If it's wet, I would put it back in for another five minutes. If it comes out and it's nice and clean and the top of it is firm, go ahead and pull those out. Okay, we're going to come back and we're going to show you how we're going to finish these off and give them a try. Okay, look at these, aren't they beautiful? Okay, now once these come out of the oven, you wanna be really fast to get these things out, like that there. The longer they sit in the pan, the worse they'll stick. So you wanna get them out as fast as you can. There we go. We're gonna line a plate with these. Okay, here we go. We cut one into thirds. Look how fluffy that looks. Mm, it smells delicious. Mm -hmm. Want a piece? Oh, I, you know, I want a piece. I got my fork ready. Can <laughs> you get a piece? All right, we're going to try it. Mmm. Oh, that's really good. Mm -hmm. It's very moist inside. Mm -hmm. Very flavorful. I love when the eggs, when you put all those seasonings in there, it just explodes. Mmm. -hmm. Mm. Really delicious. Y'all let me know down below what you are putting into your egg cups. Mm. We'd really like to know. <laughs> There's so many ways you can make these. Oh, yeah. All right. We're all looking for a thumbs up for this one, you guys. Happy Mother's Day to all the mothers out there. Make sure you comment down below if you're new to the channel. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below in that bell notification. And make sure you share the video with your friends and family. <laughs> And comment down below as well. I'm on Facebook, and don't forget to check me out on my blog, recipe, my recipe blog also, www.catherinesplates.com. All right, we will see you on our next episode.